we're back to advanced reporting. In this video, we're going to be looking at highlighting variables or attributes or rows in a table within your report. So this is advanced reporting on how to highlight values in a table based on a condition. Let's get going. So I'm back in my report that's still open. Uh, we have got this carcass data set inside our report. We've added it to our report canvas here. So what I want to do is I want to first click on this cause of death value here. The square brackets means that these values here are automatically um, populated when the report is run. The bottom property editor, there's this highlights option here. I want to left click on that. And this is where we're going to build our condition. So I'm going to add here a condition where the cause of death is equal to. Now there's a lot of different functionalities here, but if it is equal to uh, a certain value, so in this case, um, trapping. Also, you can use this expression builder here to be able to build further expressions if you don't feel like you can do it here. If it's a string format, then make sure that it's got these double thingamajiggies. So if the cause of death is equal to trapping, apply a specific highlighting. So make it 14, change the color of the text to blue and bold it, and make sure that you background color becomes gray. I click OK, and I'm gonna do it with a few others. So now here, I'm gonna do poisoning. I want to make sure that the color is orange, that this color is gray, is bold, and there's 14, click OK. Now at the bottom here, if I click on it, you'll see the preview on the right hand side for the changes and make sure you click save. Now you can go on and do it, for example, with each one of these rows. So for example, waypoint date, if I need to add another condition, I say if cause of death is equal to trapping, apply the same concept so that I can create a row of highlighted things. So if that is equal to trapping, then highlight this. You'll see the result now. So I'm just going to click save and I'm going to run it so that you guys can see the results. So right click run report on all dates. As you can see, here's my report. You can see there's the waypoint date that's been highlighted. So you can do the same concept across all so that all of this would be then highlighted in gray or orange. Even if you don't want to do uh, change the color of the text, you can just make it sure that it's highlighted. Cool. Hope that helps.